Southern Alberta Health Professionals recently received life-saving training during a unique learning experience in Brooks. A group of 10 physicians and several nurses took part in a first-of-its-kind emergency cesarean hysterectomy course on May 3rd at Brooks Health Centre. Sponsored by RPAP and the Brooks and District Health Foundation, the session was a first for rural physicians and nurses in the Alberta Health Services South Zone. The full-day team environment training included classroom and hands-on instruction in the operating room with simulations of how to perform an emergency hysterectomy on artificial tissue. The worst thing that can happen if you do a cesarean section is patient is bleeding significantly where her life is at risk. In certain cases that will go into the need of a cesarean hysterectomy which is actually a very advanced skill but what if you're out here and there's nobody around to help you so it's good to get uh, a basic skill set that you at least know what to do and uh, get these patients out of here alive. I, I think none of us has done anything like this before, so it, it's all new territory. We're used to seeing patients and, and performing procedures. So we're very fortunate that the Brooks Health Foundation gave us funding to, to procure. With the help of RPAP, uh, we secured appropriate funding to procure a unit and, and had uh, 10 artificial uteruses which we could practice and simulate uh, surgical complications on. Training like this where you're dealing with a crisis state and knowing how to interact with that uh, and, and how to deal with it and, and being prepped in your mind on how to manage it allows that skill set to be sustained over a longer period of time. In having education like this, I think it's really important for patient safety and you know for the staff to really feel that they're advocating for their patients. Certainly in a rural setting, when you're faced with emergency situations, you feel a little bit overwhelmed and so anything you can do to feel a little bit less so is a good thing. This benefits me by uh, helping my confidence level in difficult situations and that's good for my patients. They're extremely low events, maybe we only do one in our lifetime, um, but when it does happen it's a life-saving sort of procedure um, and so the opportunity to practice it um, with someone who knows who's, who does hysterectomies on a regular basis and to kind of give us some tips and take us through the learning process is huge. You know, I think this transpires to safer deliveries, better, better for moms, better for babies, um, less uh, cost on the healthcare system. Overall, I, I think benefits in, in all directions. I encourage physicians all over to Alberta that provides enhanced surgical skills and, and obstetrical skills to, to participate in a course like this.